Hello and welcome back to the Working From Home with NCASE video series. In this video, we will be covering how to create and use a collection criteria slash search condition to use with the enhanced agent feature within the NCASE investigative solution. We will begin by going over the basics of criteria and their use in constructing enhanced agent jobs for use on remote endpoints that go off a company's network. To review, a collection criteria slash search condition must be used in enhanced agent collections since the free space of the endpoint itself is used to temporarily store the results of the collection. A collection criteria slash search condition is a compilation of search terms that instructs the NCASE investigative solution to find certain files and folders based on their individual match to those terms. For relatively simple collections, the in-case investigative solution offers many built-in, commonly used default conditions, which can be used to identify the desired files and folders for an enhanced agent collection. For a condition which requires a more elaborate condition criteria than what is offered by an out-of-the-box condition, in-case investigator provides a robust mechanism for constructing sophisticated collection criteria based on nearly any logical combination of metadata fields. Let's examine a scenario. In our scenario, let's suppose we are interested in acquiring only the Microsoft Word or the DocX documents from an endpoint that were created between the dates of January 1st, 2019 and April 1st, 2019, or between January 1st, 2020 and April 1st, 2020, and we wanted to deploy the enhanced agent to do so. As is the case with any collection performed by NCASE, we start by creating a new case or opening an existing case within Endpoint Investigator and selecting Add Evidence. After selecting the Add Network Preview, we select the Add Safe Network Preview option, log into the safe, and then preview the endpoint that you, we wish to deploy the Enhanced Agent job to. At the resulting evidence screen, go to the drop down process evidence menu and go to the acquire data remotely option. Select the workstation you've just previewed and hit next. This will prompt the safe to push the enhanced agent component to the workstation and bring you to the acquisition criteria screen. Select the device you wish to perform the enhanced agent collection against, the C logical volume in our example on the top half of the screen, and then select the appropriate condition, collection criteria for the job. As mentioned before, NCASE Investigator offers many built-in, commonly used default conditions under the default folder. For our scenario, however, we need to create a custom collection criteria. Start by selecting the user folder and hit New on the menu bar. Rename your criteria by renaming the end condition file at the top. Now start building your criteria by clicking under the main folder and hit selecting new. In our example, the first condition term is the file extension must be equal to docx. Select the appropriate property, file extension, the correct operator, matches, and the value. And hit OK. You have successfully entered the first term of your criteria. The next term in your criteria is a little bit more complicated. It involves having the file created date falling between one of two date ranges. To accommodate this logic, we will need to right click under the main folder again, and this time selecting the new folder option. Let's rename our folder as date range. By right clicking on the folder so a reader can quickly identify the nature of the terms within. Now create subterms under the date range folder by right clicking on that folder and hitting new. Just as before, select the correct property, operator, and value for the term. In this case, that would be the file created, range, and the values. And hit OK. 
there is a second date range to consider. Again, right click on the date range folder and hit new. Select the property operator and value for that term. And hit OK. You have successfully entered the second term of your criteria. Notice that any new term entered into the main folder or any subfolders you create will be entered as an OR term with any previously entered terms. If you wish to toggle the logic for all the terms within a folder between OR and AND, simply right click at that folder level and select Change Logic. In our scenario, we will wish to change the logic at the main folder level since we are interested in files that have a docx extension and were created between the date ranges we specified. As a final note, you can also change the logic of a term or folder to the logical opposite by right-clicking on the term or folder and selecting NOT. Hitting OK after your terms have been entered will save your collection criteria. That criteria should now be visible under the user folder for use with an enhanced agent job.